Hello and welcome to Access DNR, the monthly video newsletter from the Maryland Department of Natural Resources. In this episode, we get a glimpse of a future state park, check out the prowess of our lifeguards, work to stop sediment from entering the bay, and more. I'm your host, Anna Lucenti Hoffman, and this is Access DNR. For our first story, we travel to Cecil County to set our eyes upon what will soon become Bohemia River State Park. At an open house event hosted by our partners, the Eastern Shore Land Conservancy, Maryland Park Service personnel provided information and offered hayride tours of the spectacular property to an eager crowd. The park will open next year. Up next, we head to Y Island Natural Resource Management Area in Queen Anne's County for the graduation ceremony of the Maryland Conservation Corps. During the event, remarks were made by Deputy Secretary Joanne Throw, Maryland Park Service Deputy Superintendent Chris Bushman, and others. During their year-long commitment, Corps members make countless invaluable contributions to public lands and community programs across the state. We are so very grateful for their service. Later in the month, we travel to Gunpowder Falls State Park in Baltimore County for yet another opportunity to celebrate the accomplishments of staff, but of a different sort, our lifeguards. At an annual competition that brings together crews from around the state, participants competed in a variety of challenging events that showcased their physical fitness and life-saving skills. Congratulations to the Assateague State Park Beach Patrol for their impressive victory. In Harford County, our cameras were also on hand to capture moments from the second annual Conowingo Dam Summit. As part of the event, Governor Hogan assembled the Chesapeake Bay Cabinet to discuss solutions for abating the dam's sediment load before it further compromises Maryland's Bay restoration initiatives. While there, Governor Hogan joined Natural Resources Secretary Mark Belton and Environment Secretary Ben Grumbles in the air to gain another perspective of both the dam and the river. Looking forward, it'll soon be time to take in all the splendor of autumn's glory with the changing of the leaves. For all the foliage fanatics out there, know that the department provides a resource to help track and time peak foliage across the state. Check out our website and begin planning your own autumn adventures today. Well, that's it for this month. For the latest events, news, or programs, please be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter, subscribe to our magazine and newsletter, and download our free mobile app. For those of you on YouTube, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to share our videos with your family and friends. I'm Anna Lucenti Hoffman. Thanks for joining us. We will see you next month.